What's up, guys? Let's go on in here. See what I've been up to. Woo-wee! Is it cool in here? I ain't lying, man. All right. Let me get this thing situated. I bumped it when I was coming in here. All right, I'm out in the new shop. I have not been filming this, so I wanted to do an update. There just hasn't been an interest in this build, so the views were barely, hardly had, had any views, so I'm not gonna film it, but I will do updates on it, and then maybe when we move on to something else, people will watch the channel. I don't know, that's YouTube, man. So anyway, let's take a look what we got got a little painting done I built this little bench instead of building a, you know a full one I think a little island here now this is where my vice can go on it's much better as you can see I started putting the pegboard on the side there that's all that's gonna have I did make one cabinet door this morning got it hung It'll need to be adjusted once I get the other one on, but as you can see, it's just made out of pegboard, and that's it. I'll take some paint and paint those screws. I tried using the brad nailer on that, and just fly, they just flew out. I did not want to take, so we're going to build two, three more here, and I'm debating whether or not to put a door here or not. I may not. I may just leave this one open but I could change my mind I built this a little different style but it's just like a little island uh, maybe just to have my vice I think that's the perfect spot for it I did beef that up under there because to me that's better than having it right in the middle of the bench where it would have to be here so yeah, I gotta, yeah these look real dirty I gotta touch this white up because I've been in here working on it building them the build blah, blah, built that door right on the bench then uh, I got the pegboard now to go here on the back I think I'll put a little piece here for this bench and some back here now this is the size of the laser this is one of my laser machines it's been in the shed I hope this thing still works it's been bounced around for a few months it should be no problem all the brains are in this thing right here and I had that removed so I just need to dust it off. I still got one more laser machine in the box. I will have to do a review on very soon. So we'll be putting that together. I did not put like a, oh, I don't think this was in the last update. I put like a backsplash on this one. But I haven't put one there yet because I brought this out. And I don't know how big the other one is. So if the other one's about the, the same size as this, then I can put a backsplash and I got plenty of room. But I'm leaving it off for now. And that's about all I've done. But I'm going to tell you that just, just doing that today and getting the painting done, that was a good... Painting was a good part of the day yesterday. And I didn't do too great of a job under here because, well... There's going to be stuff in there. Why, why waste your time and didn't paint the back ones back there? No sense in that. That one I made look a little better in case I leave that exposed. Uh, but they're nice strong benches and I went, did go again our piece of plywood. So I was able to build that and I have some more left. And for just that right there, I haven't, I've just been using my scrap. And I should be able to get two or three more. I should be able to get the rest of these cabinets with just that scrap and that will leave me my pegboard for these walls and then to finish this up here and the way I'm doing the pegboard I haven't really but I think I'm gonna frame it in one by fours and then I'll have me some LED lights up here give me some extra lighting but I'll tell you what that's pretty good just having that light it's more than light enough in here now I think what I may do the floor I haven't bought anything for the floor yet I may try to paint that before I buy anything 
because it is just a shop and if I can get away with painting it I mean here's where I spilled paint I mean yeah purposely tested paint that's just a little light coat but I think it would paint well this is a very durable flooring let me get down here and see if y'all can see that a little bit I don't know what kind of material it's kind of like a masonite material I'm not sure said it's got a guarantee a lifetime guarantee on it but we'll see <coughs> so this is where I'm at not much more to show uh, haven't even haven't even started over in this corner yet it takes materials and I'm, I'm just about out of two by fours and everything else and it's the tight time of month so we're gonna we're just using the materials we have and see how that goes so one more last look and we'll get on out of here but it kind of goes well with the ceiling the doors really make it pop <laughs> I gotta tell you guys a story so this morning let me show you I got these ring cameras or not ring blink blink cameras and I got one in here in the in the chicken pan. It's actually right up. Come here, Waddles. Oh, they're in there lounging around. But it's right up in here where I can see the the chickens at night. Well, it's got a speaker on it where I can talk to them. So this morning they were all still up on their roost and I'm like, Waddles, what are you doing? And they all started freaking out. They had no idea what it was. If I was a predator, <laughs> I couldn't help myself. I had to do it a few more times. What do you think, Waddles? Was that mean? He did not. You look like a penguin. You look like a penguin. You stand straight up like a penguin, and then you walk like a duck. He can't help it. He just, he's just Waddles. There he goes, waddling off. What do you think, boy? Did I scare you this morning? Ah, uh, waddles. All right, well, that's about it. Uh, I will try to get more done the next few days. We'll do another update and then move on to something else because this is getting old, man. I've been out here forever. It's just everything that I've done in this shop has been time consuming, very time consuming. But I do know in the end, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna be, I'm gonna enjoy the results, even though it took me forever. I mean, that ceiling was a couple of weeks and the benches, the pegboard, all that. I'm thinking four or five more days, I should be pretty close with the shop part. But I gotta get gotta get this thing going so I can start using it and start gathering up all my tools. Uh, the constant search for tools kills me when I'm doing projects because I don't know where nothing is and it, and it takes time to find these things. And it's always been that way here. So this is one of the ideas is to get all the tools in the one place so you know where they are. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll. See you on the next one. Happy trails.